What's up guys welcome back to yet another video. So we have a new update rolling out for OnePlus 10 Pro which is based on Oxygen OS 12.1. So in this video let's quickly go through what all changes they have done with this latest update for OnePlus 10 Pro. So without wasting any more time let's get started. Here we have our OnePlus 10 Pro which is running on the latest build of Oxygen OS 12.1 which was released yesterday and I've been using this device as my primary phone since the time the OTA update have been rolled out. If you guys haven't received the OTA update download links will be given in the description below. Just go to about section, system update and select local update section. You should find the file which you have placed it inside the internal storage. So here you can see this is the file of latest build of Oxygen OS 12.1 for OnePlus 10 Pro. On this update, we have got the 5th May 2022 security patch and the build number is version A.14. And guys, before moving ahead, let's keep a like target of 500 likes on this video. We still have 82% of users who haven't subscribed to our channel. So if you guys find our videos helpful to you, do consider subscribing and also press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video. Now first, let's take a look at the benchmark results on this latest build. So with the Geekbench application, our OnePlus 10 Pro have scored 997 with single core and 3273 with multi core. On the previous update, scores were 989 with single core and 3347 with multi-core. So slightly lower benchmark results to be seen under multi-core scores. With Antutu benchmark application, a device have scored 7,74,957. On the previous update, scores were 7,37,661. So better benchmark results here with the Antutu benchmark application. And we also did a CPU throttling test as always. And trust me guys, this is the first time wherein I did not see any kind of dips in the graph. If you check out our previous video, there were few dips and throttling issues. And here maximum CPU throttled up to 93%, which is a great thing. And now talking about the change logs. So this update doesn't bring any kind of new add-ons to the previous build, or you can say on OnePlus 10 Pro. Few optimizations have been done, which we'll talk about them in this video. So first one, they have improved the overall stability of the device. Till now, I did not see any kind of jitters on this build. Device is performing pretty well. But as always, we'll be doing a complete review and we'll decide on the performance part and the stability part. In a review video, we'll cover almost everything like camera performance, gaming part, battery backup and bugs if I encounter anything. So stay tuned for that. We'll be soon creating a community poll for the review video. After that, OnePlus have also fixed some stutter issues with the Bluetooth when the device is connected to Bluetooth car kit. So I personally don't have a car to test it out, but with my normal Bluetooth buds, I did not find any kind of issues yet. So if you guys have encountered this issue on previous build and if you have a car, then do try it out and let me know in the comment section below. And another fix is related to audio recording on the device. So OnePlus have mentioned that they have fixed the noise issues which used to occur while recording the audio. So I guess here they are talking about the audio recording using the recorder app. So here is the audio recording which we recently did and I personally don't find any kind of noise in this audio recording. After that, we have got the Android security patch of 5th May 2022. Next change logs are related to camera application wherein they say they have fixed the issue of HDR photos might be overexposed in some cases. So I clicked few pictures and all these pictures were shot before and after updating the device. I did not find much of difference in the picture quality using HDR mode before and after update. But you guys can take a look at the samples and let me know which one is better. Before update pictures are better or after update pictures are better. And at last they have optimized the call quality though I never faced any kind of issues with the calling stuff on my OnePlus 10 Pro. But if you guys have faced then do let me know in the comment section below. So guys this was a quick look on the latest update for OnePlus 10 Pro. If you still have any kind of questions let me know in the comment section below. This is your friend Ashok signing out. See you guys in the next video.